to a, another day in the life, but it's going to be the day in the life of a content creator slash influencer. We got a couple things on the agenda today that I want to get done that I want to do. So I'm going to take y'all along with me as I do that. First things first, we're going to get our day started. But I just want to say those real quick before I, you know, kind of, you know, get the day started and start doing things to prep for filming today. If anybody was thinking about being a content creator, I hear a lot of people give advice about it, but I will say it starts in your head first. I hear a lot of people giving advice about like, oh, you know, you have to post consistently and you have to post at this time. You have to use these habits. That's fine. And that, that, that very well may be a part of it. But you have to think. If you think you, if you say you want to be a content creator, you have to, it's, it's a mindset and you do have to treat it as though it is a job. And I don't necessarily treat it like it is a job because I feel like a job is like your it's an obligation. You want to have fun with it, but at the same time, you have to get yourself into some routines. And I'm saying this to myself, but also to other people who may want to be a content creator. You have to get yourself into a routine and you have to get, you know, get in the habit of writing things down, especially if ideas come to you that you want to talk about and don't put too much pressure on yourself. So... Just a little FYI to me and to anybody else who wants to be a content creator, but it's too much in your head about it. Get out of your head and just make the content. Like, it starts in your mind, granted, like, so you think like a content creator, but at the end of the day, don't think too much about it. Just make the content. But before we get the day started, we're going to get some breakfast. So, let's go. I've eaten my breakfast. I'm in my closet trying to pick out something to wear and then we'll hop in the shower. But I think I'm gonna wear a sweatsuit um, for filming today because I'm gonna be in the house. So I mean, might as well just be comfortable. Um, Can y'all see like these are all of the... A lot of people ask me how I pick out my clothes and like, because I'm kind of aware of like what a lot of stuff in my closet is, sometimes I just know what colors I want to wear. Sometimes I can tell like, oh, this is purple, or this is this, and this is that. Now, I'm not saying I know the color of everything in my closet, but I pretty much know like the inventory of what's in my closet. But I think I'm going to wear, um, I don't know what I'm going to wear. I'm not supposed to I'm gonna wear. I think I'm just going to pull. I'm just going to pick up. Um, we're gonna wear this one. We're gonna wear this sweatsuit and we're gonna call it a day. And then after we do that, we can film. Well, after we shower, of course, we can film the content that we need to film for the day. All right, it has been hours later. I have showered clearly. My skin is skinny. I want to show y'all what the outfit was. It's just a regular pair of sweats, the same one that I showed y'all, a little plain old sweatsuit, because I'm in the house and I'm filming and I might as well be comfortable. And I try to do something right here, so you hear me. But I'm about to film the first video of the day and get that done and out of the way so that way we can have something to work maybe next week or this week or, you know, whenever I can get back, so. 